and welcome to day 28 and 29, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, October 2020. Um, so, to Wednesday the 28th asks us what will matter in our lives a year from now. That's really quite tricky because what will matter a year from now or matter next week? We have no idea. So yesterday we looked at Jeremiah 12, 11, um, For I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. God knows our plans. So it doesn't matter what we're facing this year or next, but God, God has those plans and he will walk with us. And day 29 looks at hope and positivity in finding a new perspective on a problem. I'd rather not see it as a problem, but more of a difficulty. We can find hope in God during our difficult times. So what is our biggest difficulty? There's so much that's happened um, this year. Covid has been a very big difficulty for many, many people, whether it's from jobs or money. And it's just been quite a worrying, difficult time. And how can we find hope and a new perspective on our difficulties? One of the things that I've loved, I, you've heard me say it so many times, is the communities coming together. Our community is brilliant and I've not lived here that long and I know that the community is absolutely fantastic. And as a ministry team and church, we're looking at connecting, connecting with God, connecting with one another and connecting with our community. Connecting with each other helps us find a new perspective on our difficulties. Uh, in the news this week we've heard about the difficulties of people finding money to feed their children and that's just devastating that people are going to bed hungry. Um, but community, I've seen People have just come together to provide support, not just for food, but for providing support for different people. It's just amazing to say, to see. And in 1 Corinthians 12, 12, unity and diversity in the body, just as a body, though one, has many parts, but all its many parts from one body. So it is with Christ. Just as a body, no one has many parts and each one of you has a great part that can bring hope to other people. Well, I look forward to seeing you in a couple of days. Take care. Bye.